Hey everybody, we got some new leaks, and yeah, I'm not dead, I'm back. The thing we've most been looking forward to is the new Clone Legion skins, which have been leaked for over six months now. And guess what? They're only releasing two. So, that's pretty disappointing, but I guess it's okay because they're going to be spreading them across the whole Clone Wars season. If it's starting now, we're not really sure. But they're going to release two now, two later, probably Obi-Wan's Legion when he comes out, and then the 501st when Anakin comes out, and then some in between. The two skins that we're going to be getting for all classes is the 41st, which is the Camouflage Kashyyyk Troopers, and a 327th Legion, which is what Commander Bly is. Each of them are going to be rare, which means that they cost 20,000 credits each. Now I'm not sure how exactly this is going to work, but supposedly there's going to be a pack of three skins that you can get for 40,000, so you save 20,000 credits. For example, you can buy a pack for each of the Specialist, the Assault, and the Heavy, which are the ones that are going to be using these clone skins. That way, instead of spending 60,000 credits on one Legion for all your classes, you can just buy the 40,000 pack, so you get all three skins for your classes from that one Legion, and you save 20,000 credits. The Naboo hangar map is going to be in Stray, and possibly in Arcade, but we're not sure. Also, Jetpack Cargo is rumored to be part of the Naboo hangar map. The emotes and victory poses are supposedly going to be 1,000 credits each, which is pretty cheap, actually. The rumors going around about the hero cost for unlocking them for the first time is going between 35,000 credits and 45,000 credits, but it seems that we're most likely going to be getting them for 35,000 credits each, which is Obi-Wan and General Grievous. Also related to hero news, the Galactic Assault hero cost is going to be supposedly reduced, but I can't confirm that, nor anything in this video, but let's move on. The last game-related news we have is that there will be a Clone Wars map playlist, which means that you could select this option and only play on the Clone Wars maps. I know that I'm going to be using this because my favorite maps are all three of the Clone Wars maps. The last bit of news that we have is that the patch will be coming out on the 29th, which is a Wednesday next week, and the new updated roadmap will be coming this Friday, August 24th. So what do you guys think about this? A lot of people are angry because that there are only two skins, but personally, I'm not too upset because I know that we'll get more in the future rather than all at once and less in the future. So it's all the same. If you enjoy this video and you want to see more, make sure you hit that subscribe button and like button, and I will see you guys in the next video. Go!